Alrighty, so this is an implementation here built by Jason on our team, actually one of our newer developers who recently joined. Um, the goal of this implementation, in essence, was to build a scheduled function for managing renewing services, right? So the kind of the goal here, right, is this client uh, provides managed services. Um, some of the services that they provide are kind of like a recurring revenue stream. Others are just products or, you know, single term things that don't auto renew. And the challenge was essentially what they were doing is pulling reports um, basically every day, every week on renewing services that had passed their renewal or expiration date, and then manually going through kind of updating those records, sending the email notifications, right, managing all of those steps about the renewal. Um, what the client kind of realized is that, well, a lot of these things could probably just be scripted out. So what we went ahead and did is we built out a scheduled function. Um, the function's first goal was basically just to find all of the services that are flagged as renewable, um, where that renewal date is today, right? And then it looks at a different field on the record that defines if it should renew every three, every six, or every 12 months. Um, and then it will basically create the new renewal date that will be become the next renewal um, for that product. And then based on those dates, right, when a renewal date is, you know, 10 days away, five days away, we can then automate email communications going out, right? So, you know, hi, Jason, your, uh, you know, server rack with the serial number 12345 is going to have a renewing payment in five days, um, you know, let us know if you need any changes, right? So as these dates are being updated automatically on the back end, all of those notifications can be properly automated on the front end so that, really for any of these products that are auto renewing, we're not really having to do much work, right? To get that renewal processed. Really, as long as the customer doesn't reach out and request any changes or request a cancellation, um, on the CRM side, everything is just gonna happen automatically, right? So at the end of the day, you know, some of our implementations are big, crazy things. Some of them solve for these core kind of point problems where we're just saving some manual labor that has to be done really regularly. Um, and, you know, now the client can use that time every week to do something else, right? And, and that's always kind of the goal um, for these processes where the same thing needs to happen every single time. Um, why not take a crack at automating it? Uh, so big shout out for Jason on this one. Client was super stoked to have this done. Uh, big goal for this client is always just getting time back in the day. So this will save him a little bit of pain and suffering here uh, for a process he was doing pretty darn often, right? Managing these renewals. Yeah, good job, Jason.